Yeah, I remember the first time I met Stefan Pastis. Um, actually, I, I don't remember the first time I met Stefan Pastis. Uh, he tells me that it was at the uh, Rubens in 1999 that we met on an elevator, but uh, I think that the story really goes that that's when I met um, Bill Retchen, who does uh, Croc, and um, somewhere along the line, uh, I guess Stefan made that story about himself. Um, so, truth be told, I didn't know who Bill Retchen was either. So, I remember the time that um, uh, Stefan phoned me up and um, he said, um, I just want to tell you how much I really like your comic strip. And, um, and I remember saying, um, I told you to stop calling here. Yeah, I remember uh, Stefan saying, well, I've got this uh, a great idea for um, a religious comic strip. And he said that uh, it was going to be called Pearls Before Swine, and that it had a mouse and a, and a pig, and he was going to name them, you know, Jesus and Paul and uh, Luke, and all the characters had biblical names. And I said, all right, dude, I think that's a big mistake. And he, he kind of went with it until just before publication. Um, he got talked out of it, and uh, he went with, uh, just out of desperation, he went with rat and pig and zebra and, you know, just because they didn't know what else to do, but uh, I like to think that I had a hand in that. Stefan uh, likes to tell the story about how he met uh, Charles Schultz in the uh, in the role or the ice skating rink back before he was uh, when he was just a lawyer, and um, that never happened. Uh, that's that's just all part of his little story that he tells about himself. It, it made sense with the you know I used to be a lawyer. And then I decided to be a cartoonist story, but um, as far as I know, he was never even a lawyer. Um, he doesn't know anything about the law, as far as I know. Um, he used to work in a Home Depot in the um, in the ad adhesive section. Um, yeah, I, he doesn't know anything about law, uh, but he does know a lot about glue. So.